Hello, and welcome back to the cave. <sighs> Last time we found three minecarts for a miner, and I think we were to blame for the minecarts disappearance, so that was fair enough. Now I am double checking upstairs whether there should be more places to use dynamite. But uh, no, that seems actually that it isn't. So um, we will go back down. The miner wasn't such a bad guy. He was down here a long time, and that'll take its toll. Obtaining the thing you desire most isn't always as hard as it's made out to be, but it will change you. And that, my friends, is what's hard. Okay. So the gold is down here, and... Years later, a job at the carnival. Okay. So, what do we have here? And over here, we've got... <coughs> that not for any of us. Nope. So, Okay, so we can't do anything here. Okay, and we can just continue. I feel a caution here. is in order, for we are about to enter a very grim part of our journey this evening. Grim not because of the atrocity we are about to witness, but because of who is going to commit it. I speak of those darling children, the twins. Watch, but don't be afraid to avert your eyes, especially if you yourself are a parent. And you enjoy making soup. <laughs> okay, a bow. Lack of focus. Okay. That's one way, and I believe to get past that dog, we can use, you know, the telepath thing magic that they can do. That is two sets of them. But what's up here? I wish to you know. So it 
these take. Mm. This seems to be because there we need to use that power too. I want to know what's down there first. And that's gonna take some time. But that's fine with me. Um, Anything here or what? No. Seems there's nothing to do. And what the heck are we? We can't go past it for some reason. So, but that may be another. No, can't be another story because then it would mean to slip it. Okay, but here we can at least use our power. You don't want to know the building permit hell I went through to build that thing down here. It does have walk-in closets. It's those small touches that make the difference when it comes time to put it on the market. <laughs> oh, it was our house where we couldn't get in. Okay, super. So, how... Uh, oh. Terribly sorry, loves. I can't let you go out and play with your friends until you've had your supper. Your mum's making your favorite. <laughs> Sausage and tater soup. Alright, father or whatever. Um, but we want to go out to play, I assume, is their grand desire. <laughs> Quiet down! You don't want to disturb the dear twins. Sounds like the nice little doggy of yours is famished. Would you two be dears and go fetch him his dog food? Oh, God, eh? I think your dog would rather have some delicious dog food. Your father put it in the basement. Right, it's down in the basement. Oh. Oh, I get it, I get it. Now, when the dog is... When the dog is gone, then the others can enter the house. Yeah, of course. Mm, what do we got here? Nothing, nothing, nothing. A beautiful house in the cultural heart of Victorian London. Two loving and caring parents. What could children want more? Apparently what they desire most is freedom. Freedom from bedtimes and chores. Freedom to run wild with no one to hold them back. We're about to see what happens when two adorable children snap. <laughs> Tall enough, of course, and neither are we here. So, what do we do? We go. Why is everything locked in this house? If you stay inside without a fuss, I'll buy you each another pony. If you stay inside without a fuss, I will buy you each another pony. Alright. Um, maybe... Maybe he's favoring the girl a little there, or... I don't know. They are children. But still... I don't want a pony, I want a Lego. That's a Lego. 
use packs. And we've got the key in here and we just can't smash anything. Why can't we smash anything? Here we can't get. Hey. What do we do without that? What do we do without? Wrong way, okay. But um how the flip do we do this the best? I can't figure out a way, I can't figure out a way. Please don't touch the soup loves. You might burn your delicate little hands. This one can probably be used to get to the ceiling. So all the way up. The, uh, okay. Washroom. Okay. So up we go. That way. But that way. Devious. Okay, can we use this for anything? Or oh, it's just moving? We can use that, yes. We need the hammer here, but uh, we've got the fuse box now, so now we at least can get this to work. And it's down at the first floor. Oh, so we can. Go all the way down and get the hammer, and then we can take the elevator up, I believe, to spare time. Or something like that. Please stop barking. You know what happened to the last dog that barked too much. Would you two be dears and do fetch him his dog food? I'm Quit on my barking. way, mother. I'm not barking, mother. Let's. Yeah. I might be going out on a limb here, but I don't think those kids are as sweet and innocent as their pasty white skin and vapid, soulless eyes devoid of life would suggest. We just want to play! <laughs> Oops. Ouch! 
There goes the fine china. Don't care about the fine china, I just want to go outside and play. Ooh, there goes the broken china. Get over the step. All right. out here. And up here. Mmm, the smell of rotting sewage floating in the Thames. Thick industrial smoke choking the air, and horse manure piled high on every street corner. Ah, oh, it must be springtime in London. Go so back and go get put. Shampoo pot my face. I don't know why that should help, but maybe. Who knows? Maybe. That's where we came from to begin with, and. Dirty there, and... Please, stop your barking. You know how much the twins hate that barking. Would you two be dears and do fetch him his dog food? <coughs> Oops. Water down the... Yeah. And that's how it's gonna help us. 
and I just thought about that from the start and it was like a, a genius plan I laid. It was not an accident that I figured it out. So, um, smart me, not just lucky. Alright, but then let's go all the way up here so we can. And we are gonna wait for the next episode. Uh, hope you enjoyed and goodbye.